So on the upper right hand corner is this little information eye and that's a handy little icon. I'll show you what it does. I'm going to click on the eye and this allows me to create labels and tags and even though it says categories, uh, not yet allows for that. So here I did start typing July 4th, American flag, maybe I'll try America U.S. since it looks like that's what's going on with the photo and what I would probably write about. And then if I click on this little carrot on the right, I get all my other tags from previous posts. And I can also select those. So I might want to pick um, online marketing and you see a check mark comes up. I might want to pick um, logos. I might want to pick, oh, uh, I don't know, maybe Sprinkles Cupcakes because I think they have a flag cupcake going on. And you can see that all the icons, every time I click on it, I get a checkbox. And that's what the screen looks like. Um, you want to be careful not to clear it or all your old tabs will come off, even though they were created in the other, another program. I originally created them on Blogger on uh, my Mac. So now I'm going to go back over to Options, and I can say Done, and that'll be it. I'm skipping categories. And then here under Publish, I can publish on or off, and that will give me an online draft. And I can also select the date here. So here is today's date, but I can click on the carrot, and I can advance publish. Very nice. So I can just scroll through the calendar. I can pick the day that I want. I can pick the morning and whatever hour and minute that I want. And then I can, that's it. And I go back to options and I can say done. And that's how that works.